here we go. Vodka flavor is gone. Goggle that bitch. Yeah, <laughs> I've seen that somewhere. <laughs> Right, so. Hope not me. Because <laughs> I don't remember that. So. <laughs> Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode of the Beard Bros. It is me, Seanus. This is Jonas. Hello. Jonathan, what are we trying today? What are we doing today? Today, my friend, we are comparing the Blue AU. Uh -huh. Blue AU. Blue. And the Blue JJ Whitley. Uh, the AU and EU killer, as we called it in our last video. We did. There's a link above my head over here. You want to go look at our review of this bad boy. But today we're going to directly compare them. We're going to try them straight, try them mixed, all the usual shit we do in these, and then decide which one is best for you to spend your fucking money on, bitches. <laughs> yeah, bitches. <laughs> this AU here is a 35.2% vodka. It ranges from 25 to 40 pounds, depending Indeed. where you can get it from. Yeah. This bad boy right here, this blue, 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 is a 38% vodka, ranging from 15 to 18 pounds. And saying what we were saying in the last video, they're very similar. This very one is blue similar. in color. This one is blue in color. Um, they're the same flavor, um, just a lot cheaper. So we give them both similar scores, I believe, John. Yeah, but well, again, that was part of the thing, wasn't it? They are so similar yeah. that we couldn't really tell them apart. Again, I can't remember the last time I drank this, probably a good few months ago now. Because this was released this sort of time last year. Yeah, about now, wasn't it? Yeah, so it's been a while. Jesus Christ, that is literally exactly the same fucking color. Holy shit. So like I say, it's been a while since I drank one of these, but from kind of recollection, I think this JG might taste better, but we'll soon see. We will. So we're gonna try them straight first. Yeah, just to see. A quick straight um, shot. Well, not shot. I think. But sip. Should we go for the new, the upstart, or should we go for the old, uh, the old reliable? Let's go for the new. Let's go for the new first. So JJ's it? in these funny shaped glasses. Yep. Ching ching, brotherhood. So let's give it a try. Ching ching. Sweet. Ow. As it would be. It's blue raspberry. Mm. But it is still quite raspberry y. I kept it in my mouth for too long. Yeah. And I let the vodka. You got the burn. Yeah. You got the Yasha down the back of your throat. I burnt my tongue. <laughs> so I got the Yasha. Asha, Asha. Anyway, so. What's that fucking. Everyone knows that you've had the vodka when you go. Yeah. It's like um, Bruce Almighty, is it? It is, yeah. <laughs> 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 Right then, should we swill our mouth real quickly? With a oh, bit go of, on and let's have a little with a bit of refreshment. Just seven to... up, baby. Here we go. Vodka flavor's gone. Goggle that bitch. Yeah, <laughs> I've seen that somewhere. <laughs> right, so. Hope not me. Because <laughs> I don't remember that. So. <laughs> oh, dear God. <laughs> dear God. Hey you, going in. Ching ching. Wait. Sniff test. Very, it's different now, in my head. Sweet, sweet, isn't it? Sweet, sweet blue. Sweet for my sweet. Sugar for my honey. <laughs> different, very different. It is different, isn't it? Very sweet. Mm. Very sweet. It takes away from the vodka's edge, though. It does take away. Like, there's no burn to it. No. But there's no raspberry to it. No. It's just sweet. That is just a sweet just drink. Sweet. Right. So, dare I say, too sweet. Too sweet, baby. Right, so to the line, everyone knows the rules. Go back there, that'd be fine. Should we? Well, we're not an exact science here on the Beard Bros. We literally just, well, we're not known for our precise measures. No. And our accurate expert opinions. We're known for our banter. <laughs> and drinking blue banter. drinks. Because that's all these people seem to view. Indeed. Blue drinks. Blue. Which one should we try first? I think we go new again. New, new blue. New blue. Ching ching. Ching ching. Again, before we do, colours, colour match, very close. Nearly fucking identical. Yeah, very, very close. So, got that nice sweet flavour, but you can still taste the blue raspberry in there. Yeah. Definitely the blue Definitely raspberry. Definitely more raspberryness to it. It's the middle ground for me between the Smirnoff raspberry, which we should have here. Yeah. Even though it's not as blue raspberry. It's not. That one is very raspberry y. Yeah. From the straight shot, this one is very sweet. Yeah. And I think that's the good middle ground. Yeah. 
there's a sweetness, mm -hmm. but it's also the bit of the raspberry to it as yeah. well. Yeah, little bit of raspberry, a <laughs> blue raspberry. <laughs> We're trying to get that. We've got literally, literally, we? literally. That's the one joke we have for these, yeah. <laughs> these yeah. two videos, mate. Blue. So anyway, well, should we try this bad boy? The AU, the AU. Hang on, should we, should we swill? Oh yes, let's swill. Oh, wrong can. The AU, AU. Be good. Be good. Spooning leads to forking. All right. <laughs> Ching, ching, ching. It's better with lemonade. It is much better with lemonade. And we did have a comment on the first one saying it was a jumped up WKD. And I can see where he's coming from now. It's very, I got the WKD flavoring in my back of my throat now. Can you taste that? I can't remember the last time I drank a blue WKD, mate, to be honest. No. So, true. Probably. You're probably right. I yeah. just can't remember it myself. But yeah, it, it is a lot better with lemonade. Mm. Smooth. Just take a bit of the edge off the sweetness as well. It does. With a lemonade. A bit of that. Let me go back to this one. Zestiness. A lot sharper, whereas that's a lot more smooth. Sweeter, smoother, that's more sharp. But I think I can taste more of a raspberry now flavour in this than I really? could this. Mm, I wouldn't agree with that. No? No, not personally. Let me try. I still don't get masses of raspberry from this. There's raspberry there for me. A little bit. Especially on the aftertaste. A little bit. I think the sharpness mm -hmm. takes over on this one for me. Mm -hmm. Whereas the sweet, sweet flavours exuberate. Exacerbate? Exacerbate. I don't fucking Close know. Enough, mate. Close enough. What's exuberate? Exa exacerbate is like, bring them out. Yeah, okay, then exactly. Whatever this man just said, <laughs> it, it does that to the raspberry, in, in my view, on this one. Yeah, it complements it. It, it does, yeah. A bit more. Yeah, I, I do agree with that. Yeah. I still think there's more raspberry in this one, personally. That's, yeah. that's, that's my personal opinion. Ooh. Which goes to show we're not the same person. I was gonna say, we are two different people. Exactly. This is not a mirror in between. <laughs> what like... are you thinking then, mate? Do you think, John, oh, I think it's pretty simple, straight. If we're drinking it straight, I think this one all day yeah. long. Mm -hmm. I think this one is too sickly, sickly sweet. Yeah, yeah. Personally, mm -hmm. I think this one's the one straight. If I'm drinking straight. If I'm going on pure taste, on my view, yep. I'm liking the AU. Yeah. Mm. They are different flavors. As long they look the same, they 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 got the same name. They everything's the same. Um, Flavor-wise, though, they go into two different to the ends of the spectrum, aren't they? Yeah. That's a bit more bitter. It's not so much sweet, whereas that one is really sweet. But again, it brings out the flavors of the uh, the blue raspberry for me. I know you're saying that you you can taste more blue raspberry. I, than I was, that one, I was going to say. I think we might be diverging here. But again. Different palettes and all that. But again, yeah, different palettes. Again, it's not it's not bad. No. It's just this one for me. It's just a little bit better. Yeah, for me. The, the argument I would say with that is, if you had to drink one of these for more than just one drink now, mm. I think you get sick of this one before you get sick of this. Yeah, yeah, the, yeah. I, it's sickly sweet, isn't it? Yeah. Um, yeah. It might be nice to taste into you here, mm. but if you had to drink, say, like I said, say you had this bottle yeah. as your pre-drinks, before you were off out, out on a tan, you would probably get sick of it after yeah. a few drinks. Oh, yeah. You'd want something else. And my sick would be blue. Blue. <laughs> um, I, I agree. Um, but for me right now, I'm going to pick AU. I know you're going to pick. I am going to pick. Whitley. So what we're saying basically is, is I prefer this for both. Yeah. You prefer this for mixed and this for straight. Yes. So three out of four is this one. Yes. Yes. With just the outlier on this one. Yes. With you and your sweet tooth. Yes, indeed. You but sweet little bitch. Price-wise, I would much rather not spend an extra 10, 15 pound on something that is basically the same. Yeah. Um, I, I wouldn't know the difference unless I was drinking them next to each other. No. And that's what I mean. I think, you know, you can, well, you can see. Look, look at these. You can see how similar they are. Yeah. That could literally be the same drink in both yeah, of those. Agreed. They are very much the same thing. Different, like I say, slightly different flavor profiles on, yeah. pa on the palate for you. There is. But they are very much the same thing. Mm. So I think in terms of the audience these go for, yeah. these are very much aimed at 18 to yeah. 24 year olds. 100%, yeah. Going out every weekend, mm -hmm. you know, glitz and glam for the yeah. Instagram. And they're both shiny bottles. Well, they are. And, I, and like I said in the original video, I think this one might be more eye-catching yeah. than this one. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Look at this, look at this all, all the neat detail around here. This, this is a sticker, so it's not quite as great. But, you know. <laughs> um, but yeah, what do you think, mate, then? Overall, John. I think it's quite clear what my overall choice is. Yes, yes. I'm going JJ. Yeah. 
I'm going big blue. Big, big blue. blue. Big blue. It's more to my taste. Yeah. It's better straight. Yeah. It's better to me mixed. Mm -hmm. And it's a lot cheaper. Yeah. 100%. And I could drink it more. Yeah. Okay. How about yourself? So you're the deciding vote here, my friend. Well, I mean, straight, obviously it goes to the JJ. JJ off of Skins. Mix for me, it goes with the AU. Because, again, I, I, I do have a more sweet tooth than John. But then, taking away... true, I'm very bitter. <laughs> yeah, you are a bitter, I'm bitter. very man. bitter. But that's, then, then you've got to go finger the price. I mean, unless I was drinking them together, I wouldn't know the difference. I would definitely spend 10, 15 pound less on this. Because, why wouldn't I? It's, it's the same flavour. Um, well, it's the same. It's meant to be the same flavour. It's the same colour. You get the same fucking look from your drinks. You, I mean, it's shiny, it's blue. Blue. Um, I think I'm def yeah, I'm I'm gonna agree with you, John. It's definitely the JJ Whitley's the winner. Gotta be the JJ. Yeah, you man. can't. It's gotta be a JJ. The price. The price difference is too big. It's, it's like you said in the original review for this. This is your payday treat potentially. Mm -hmm. This is the one you splash out on if this is your bag. Like I say, you're looking at least twenty-five quid plus delivery. Yeah. So call it thirty quid for this one. You can get this one for fifteen or so. Yeah. More like you know, 18, whatever. This is your payday treat. This is your everyday drink. Yeah. And it's the same thing. So yeah. why would you not buy this? Yeah. Basically, that's what I think. No, yeah, no, I agree. So, goodbye you for a minute. We'll see you in a future cocktail so long, video. So long, Prince. <laughs> um, but for now, John. The winner. The winner is the JJ Whitley, baby. Well deserved, mate. Yeah, well deserved. it's good. The true AU killer, JJ Whitley. Well done. Well, fair play. I think they've done a good job. Oh yeah, yeah, they've done a good job, and it's again shit ton cheaper. So why the fuck not? Yeah, why wouldn't you? And I think, to be honest, judging by some of the comments on the original AU, I think this might be more up the street because a lot of them do say it's kind of cough syrupy, yeah, jumped up mm. shit, like you said earlier. Like the opinion seems to have changed a little bit on AU. Yeah, when it first came out, everyone was loving it. Yeah, and now it's like, mm, yeah, is it a bit too no, much? Yeah. So yeah. I think this might be. The perfect new AU. So here we have it, folks. That is the verses of JJ Whitley and the AU Blue Raspberry. And the winner is JJ Whitley. So thank you very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you find it useful. Hope it informs your spending choices. You know, go out there, spend your student loans and all that bollocks. And, you know, well, you can have two bottles of this, the price of this. Exactly. And that's the choice you want to be making with your life at 18 years old. So yeah. that's what I would say. Mm -hmm. Yeah, thank you for watching. Much appreciated as always. If you could like the video, that would be great. Share it to your friends. Tell everyone about the Beard Bros. Spread the word. Subscribe to the channel too, because that's always appreciated. We're nearly at 250 subs at the yeah. moment. So yeah. that's good. It's not bad for two Welsh boys dicking around in a fucking conservatory as it is right now. So yeah, happy days. Hit the like, comment down below if there's anything else you want us to try, you know. Let us know what you think. What do you think of these two? Which is your favorite? Tell us down below. Hit subscribe, hit the bell, get the notifications when we do more. Inevitably, we're going to do more drinks with these, aren't we? Yeah. Vibrant drinks like these. We've got done, to use them. We've, exactly. We've done cocktails with you. We'll probably do cocktails with this at some point, mate. Yeah. You know, we've got to get that, those, that money. We've got to get those videos <laughs> out there, haven't we, for our door in public. So, and that is that. Thanks for watching again, guys, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye. Bye for now, babies. <laughs>